back, back, back in the building. Mr. International, man. It's your boy Padpoint, Mr. International. You know, I'm back on my cross country shit, you know what I'm saying? City to city, city to city, you know what I'm saying? Get with me, you see me out and about, you know. Super Bowl weekend, birthday weekend, you know what I'm saying? We networking, getting to it, you know. It's a lot going on out here, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't be a part of the mix. Be the mix. You know what I'm saying? You don't try to get in the mix. Create the mix. You feel me? Yeah. That's the way you gonna elevate with this shit, man. You entertain the, you entertain the clowns. You gonna become a part of the circus. You hear me? Yeah, man. Sometimes you gotta sit back and look at it. The bird's eye view, you feel me? Whatever that mean, you know what I'm saying? You interpret that however you do. However you can conceive it and receive it, it's on you. But yeah, you gotta really be laser focused. You gotta know this shit right in front of you. Oh, player one saying, Fifer, you know what, Fifer? I don't know what you worry about, it's right in front of you. <laughs> I said, damn, man, what you, man, what is right in front of you, man? So, and this shit been about 10, 12 years. Never mind the, the, uh, the noise in the back. Some electrical shit with my dashboard. You know, I got everyday regular people obstacles, even though I'm a niche level nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm one of y'all. I'm relatable. But a lot of people can't relate because I'm so authentic. I'm so raw with this shit. I don't lie and shit. I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't get on here and try to entertain motherfuckers. And, you know, do shit to gain a lot of views and trying to go viral. Which ain't nothing wrong with it. I don't like nobody who do. It's just that I got to stay in my line. I got to stay in my pocket. It's cool, calm, and collected. You know what I'm saying? Dropping a few jewels here and there, talking my shit. On some flat nigga shit, you know what I'm saying? Focus on the invisible, not the physical type shit. So, you know, I got to document my daily struggles, my daily triumphs. You know, everything that come along with living this life I live, you know, my human experience. Yeah, my, uh, just being a father. You know what I'm saying? As a day one daddy, you know, you got a lot of, you know, uh, roadblocks and setbacks when it come to parenting because it ain't really no handbook on this shit. Getting money and maintaining money, those are some things that you can grow accustomed to, but like, fatherhood, which is the best hood to represent and to be a part of, that shit don't come with no manual, so <laughs> you know, you just gotta, you know, you gotta make the best of it and know that it's gonna be a challenge every day and just know that the only way you gonna really Rise to the occasion, rise to the challenge. It's to know that you have to face the challenge. And you know you gotta face the challenge head on more so. You feel me? Like the the the, uh, the self awareness of knowing that there's gonna be challenges. You're gonna have some good days, you're gonna have some not so good days. You know what I'm saying? But just stay true. Straight true to yourself, man. Yeah, I supposed to bend got the goddamn Dashboard cam. Uh, I suppose I got the vehicle. Uh, what they call them little cameras that you put in a vehicle. The boy money just a little funny right now. <laughs> so it's a little delay, but delay does not mean denial. It is why I'm holding the camera, moving the camera. The video might not be as stable as I would like, but you know, we gonna do this shit the way we gotta do this shit, man. You know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna say. I'm going to wait till I get this. I'm going to wait till I get that. Now nah, we're going to get the ball rolling. We're going to get this shit started. And everything else will be added to it. You know what I'm saying? With that being said, though, uh, what's the date? February the 7th, 2024. As I approach my 40th solar return, I've been, I've been recording and filming and shooting content every day. You know what I'm saying? Like, But I ain't been posting it on social media. I've been really like a one-tree a one component all on YouTube, but this video right here, 
I think I'm gonna I'm a, a drop these on uh, I'm gonna drop these on the social media platform. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go I'm gonna go to Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, and uh, turn up everything. I just been cause my my page monetized. You know what I'm saying? But as I look at the analytics and watch my numbers and shit, and just you know looking at the settings, they have changed the threshold once again. They keep on moving the needle. It's, 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 <laughs> it's just one of them things where you just got to keep going, though. You feel me? Hence why I said earlier, you got to know you got to face the challenges, man. Be aware that the challenges are going to come. And you got to be ready for them no matter when they present themselves. You feel me? But, um, yeah, man, we making these, uh, making this content because it's really like this the new block. The internet is the blade now. You know what I'm saying? Real shit. Pimp C. Ben said, you know, uh, Women ain't got to sell no tricks, no coochies, just cameras and screens. So here we are. I'm pimping myself. Now I'm pimping myself, you know what I'm saying? And I do a lot of major shit. Non-profit shit. Uh, food industry shit. Marketing, promotion, daily traveling shit. Uh, music. You know, I, I got to just really start going all the way in. To the point to where, you know... The proof is in the pudding versus me articulating it via words. Although I am, you know, pretty good with my words. I got a way with words and I got to, you know, I got to give the speak and drop the drop this science. You know what I mean? So, you know, I ain't going to stop. I just got to, you know, I got to get myself back together. I had some some pit stops and along this way in this journey and shit been trying to knock me on my pivot foot. I, I might get, you know, I might get a traveling charge here and there, but I always get it back, you know what I'm saying? And now I'm back on offense and, you know, it's time to scope, man. It's time to do the same move over and over again until a motherfucker can stop it. Yeah, you know how I used to play basketball in the hood, 21, and this one nigga that's doing one move every time, and a nigga get mad, be like, I bet you can't do nothing else. And nigga be mad because you can't stop the move that he doing. Nah, I can't do nothing else because until you stop it, I ain't going to do nothing else. You feel me? So, yeah, it might do what work for you, man. If you good at shooting three, shoot three. If you good at just bagging a nigga head down, turn around and dunk him, do that. Yeah, if you got a good a good mid-range game, go where you effective, man. Don't let nobody talk you out your comfort zone, especially when you want, when you scoring and you winning, and that shit getting you somewhere in life. You feel me? Apply that shit. Double down on that shit, man. Turn up on these suckers. Let them have it. And don't forget, get the money. Why you at it? Get it to the ass. And that's what I'm on. Big shit popping, nigga. Let's get it.